The EPA is proposing new rules to make your drinking water cleaner. The new rules would set limits on the allowable levels of PFAS, also known as forever chemicals. The chemicals used to be used in clothing, pots and pans and firefighting foam, and they don't break down, so they stick around for a long time. They can cause some serious health problems. The city of Thornton has been testing its water for these chemicals for years, and it's already working to bring down PFAS levels. The chemicals aren't so easy to get rid of, though. It will not be cheap. It generally requires an additional type of um, treatment um, technique that will go within the treatment processes to um, either fully removal, remove or substantially reduce those PFAS levels. Just even after the health advisory level came out, um, we knew we, there was no way with our existing treatment technologies to get to the health advisory level. The city of Thornton is part of a lawsuit against multiple companies responsible for making products with these chemicals. They think those companies should pay for the treatments to the water supply. The EPA will make a final decision on the allowable PFAS levels by the end of the year.